Hello everyone, Jack here from Second Gear and welcome to our final expedition of Rise of the Cho Tomb Tomb Raider. Uh, so at the end of the last episode, I showed you the cards we were going to use. I've tweaked them slightly and I think I've made them stupidly difficult. So first off, we've got Combat Specialist, which is Complete Cold Darkness without dying at all. Next one, Combat Specialist Survivor, Complete Cold Darkness on Survivor difficulty without dying. Now here's where it gets tricky. Complete the level without taking any damage. I've, I'm serious about this. I want to try and it's going to be awful. Perfectionist, shut down all the towers without making any mistakes. And kill 75 enemies in cold darkness. So we have no weapons at all. But these are just the challenges to do. We haven't even put on our cards yet. Which I've only just realised which has just made me... Like, a thousand times more scared about even doing this. Which, oh no. <laughs> prisoners, should we... Uh... Yeah, we'll do prisoners again, why not? Okay, so that's the uh, that's the challenges. Now for the cards. Oh, this is going to literally grab me by the nuts and kill me. Permanent. Extra infected grenadiers appear during the swarm. Dumb. Add a card. Cold Darkness. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Each infected swarm lasts longer than the one that came before it. That's going to be a bastard to deal with. Survival, survival instincts don't do this. Nope. Taking damage from infected spreads uh, from infected spreads the infection to Lara. Once infected keep, uh, kills keep you alive. Hell yes, because we're going for not taking any damage at all. This is going to be impossible. I said we're going to go out with a bang and that is exactly what we're going to do. Okay, the flashlight always goes out as a swarm begins. Oh... Good God. Yep, rigged. Resource chests have a chance of being equipped with an alarm that will ring when opened. And we have one final card to use. Should we give ourselves a, a weapon? I'm... What? What? Cluck, cluck. That looks like a really fun one, but... uh, I don't know. Hmm. We can get the Dream Stinger again. But we did that before. Instant reloading when weapons magazine is empty. Oh, full auto shotgun. We no, no. I'm not. I'm trying not to go with anything that uh, actually gives us an advantage because I want this to be the most ball blistering playthrough you've seen. The flashlight is like, whoa, man. Nah. Perfect timing, low battery. Oh, this is gonna be horrible. You know. What? Sparks of spark of life. The flashlight dims over time, but brightens with kills. We're going to die. So we got bomb squad, extra grenadiers, fury. The each swarm is stronger than the one before. Infectious taking damage spreads the infection to Lara, making you kill to stay alive. Rigged resource chests have a chance to uh, like uh, have an alarm when opened. And spark of life. The flashlight dims over time. That sound difficult enough for you guys? Well, I should. Fucking hope so, because this is going to hurt me. me not just emotionally, not mentally, not even physically. It's going to hurt my soul. It's got every part of my being is going to cry after this. And I'm never going to want to play Tomb Raider again. <laughs> oh dear God. What have I done? This is just a mistake. I can feel it. Oh, Jesus. And we're not right with this. Isn't going to be a speed run, by the way. Oh, no. This is going to be the exact same as our last expedition. Probably about three episodes. Progressive in each. But we cannot make a mistake on the towers. I created a weapon to protect And for that, I am proud. Then we'll load it. Oh, never mind. All right, Lara. This is it. The chemical weapon. The oh, infected no. Trinity soldiers. They're no. all coming from this old Soviet no. compound. This is the place. No. I've got the operations manual you dug up, so I can translate the directions to shut down the facility. If we can't shut down the machines, the toxin will drift into our valley within a day. Sophia's going to keep us in the air, but we'll be nearby. Other Jesus that, Christ, what have I done? Down there. Also, guys, if you're expecting... But they can definitely hear. If you're expecting um, a, like a replacement for Obscuritus, sorry, I'm just going to tell you quick. Uh, I'm keeping that slot open till Tuesday next week so we can run, what is it, Te Technomancer? I can't remember the exact name of it, sorry, it's Steam, 
Steam sale, couple of weeks, so I've got about 50 game names running through my head at the moment. But it's brand new, it gets released on the, well, Tuesday next week. So that's going to be our replacement for Obscuritas, and I'm hoping it's going to be a damn fantastic game. And then get the hell out of there, and stay safe. Wait, I'll try. we actually get a bow to begin with. Holy crap, okay, now has the map changed at all? Nope, exact same map. Well, that's nice to know. Oh, Jesus Christ, people. Revolver. Yes, please. Oh, shut up. That was a headshot. No. I'm not failing this. Oh, fuck. No. I'm sorry. We just failed. Oh. <laughs> We just failed two challenges in the space of like five seconds. That is appalling. I would have thought, oh no, it's a, um, it's not a upgraded bow whatsoever, is it? It's literally as blank as blank could be. Nope. Nope. Come on. Come here. So we can still two shot melee these guys. Oh, I think I want to actually restart this. Oh god, guns don't. Die. Die. No. Oh, sweet merciful god. This is bad. This is really freaking bad. Alright, we have completely... Grew this at the moment. I just don't... I don't, I don't know an easy way to kill him. Nope. Jump down. Get him. And of course, the explosive came down with him. Naturally. Okay, uh... She said there's a prisoner up here, but we can't actually get up there. Sorry, I just had, I thought I heard something. Oh my god, what have I done? I'm sorry that we've already failed two challenges. I was maybe a tad over ambitious as to my ability on this game. What is hurting me? Right. Nope, come here you. We should have just gone for the silent brawler type. I just literally beat our way through the infected. Oh, seriously. Really? Can someone hear me? Oh no, we've been in I just remembered. The infection. The infection spread Solara. Oh shit, we're screwed. We're dead. We're dead. Like seriously, if we need to kill to survive, we we're already screwed, people. Come on. Please, please, kill him. Oh, what have I done? Really, I should restart this because we failed two challenges. I really feel like I should, but I don't know if we will have access to the same ones. Shut up, I'm trying. Double shot. Okay. One out of six prisoners. Do we still get the void hammer? No, we got to rescue uh, what they were 15. Ah, oh, it's in total, not just in one run. Do this on purpose. They must have been out here looking for the source. I've just realised how valuable Dream Stinger Level Five was. Holy shit! I said I wanted to do this run with guns as well, just because it's louder, it's more intense, you know. So uh, I think we're going to stick with that. Why, thank you kindly, but I need to kill this guy first. But I can't, because he's got a helmet. And there's weapon cache all the way over there. Okay, there's an infected here. Come on, let me... Thank you! Come here, boy. Oh, this killing to stay alive business is not going to be good. It's going to suck so bad. Please make it. Thank you. Don't have an alarm. I forgot I put that one on too. I've forgotten every single modifier we've put onto this so far. I'm scared, people. I am genuinely scared right now. Because I don't know how long it takes for us to die from uh, infection or not. Or I don't know how long it takes for us to die from infection because we are infected. Right, uh, what's over there? Well, we definitely need a new weapon. And I need more kills. Right, he's already seen us. Come on, two hits, two hits, two hits. There you go. Right, he doesn't know we're here. That's good. Right, he might though in a minute, so let's get the hell out of here. 
make our way around to that weapon over here. Hopefully it's going to be a shotgun, because shotgun's going to save my ass. As we found out, uh, it one-shots them all. What the hell happened to them? Well, not so much one-shot. You know what I mean. Don't be an alarm. Don't be an alarm. Oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, come on, Lara. we got to move a little bit quicker than this. Otherwise, we're going to die. And I don't know where... Oh. Drop, 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 drop. Reco uh, compound bow. Yes, please. Sweet. Okay, the bow's just become usable yet again. Sorry, Dejan. I know I said I was going to do this, like, flawlessly, but... Oh, my God. We're going to die. Oh, my God. Okay, okay, okay. We can at least heal the infection. But obviously not totally. Right, where is this guy I'm hearing? I don't I see him. Uh-oh. Nope. Get out of here. Get out of here. Oh, this is such a bad decision to use a shotgun. Goodbye to your face, my friend. Grenade up. Or grenadier, whichever you prefer. Right, don't waste the ammo. Don't waste the ammo. Just... Holy shit, this grenadier one is ridiculous. Run for your goddamn life. Nope. Okay, 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 okay. We're alright. There's only one left. We've got a compound bio as well. We just haven't got that quick draw. It doesn't seem to... Wait, you, you wasn't even there a second ago. What the hell? You know, I think it makes it a bit more difficult already being infected within two seconds. I just wish I didn't die right there. That was just... Oh, no. Come on. This is such a bad decision. No. This is not fair if he explodes, you dick. Come on. Why can't we have some animation immunity here? Some iframes would go a long way. You pricks. How far have you thrown me backwards? Son of a bitch. Wait, nope. That, there we go. Oh, my life. Right. There's no infected around here. Kind of scares me. Okay, there's no point having your bow out when the bow will do literally jack shit to these things. The dream, even just the uh, hallucinogenic features of the Dream Stinger was so useful here. All right, he's coming. There you go. Right, so we've healed up a tiny bit. We need to get back around there and get the tactical shotgun as well. Don't be here. I'm not hearing him. Okay, okay. Give me that shotgun. Oh, Jesus Christ. What have I let myself in for here? Granted, obviously it's hell on earth. I think we saw a weapons cache on our last flyby. Want to take a Wait, look? Weapons cache where? Alright, I need as many weapons as I can get. Uh oh, not that way. Not that way. Where is it? Is it in here? Yeah, survival instincts would have been a bitch. Oh, thank God. Something that's not a revolver. I'm lucky the toxin doesn't seem to affect women. Not yet. Okay, so we're going to head over to this tower first, anyway, same as last time. I suspect it alters dihydrotestosterone production, which would explain the aggression, the rapid muscle growth, and why it affects men so quickly. Yeah, that sounds... sure. Okay, the compound bow is still a boss of a bow when it comes to damage. Fire rate is hot trash, but... Yeah, I'm outside can, the first of the towers now. If you can drop something in okay. one hit, no when worries. You enter, the airlock will shut behind you. You're going to have to find another way out once you shut down the machinery. Okay. Uh, wasn't there a prisoner in here, or would they have changed, switched it up? I think it's worth a check. You have to hurry, please. Okay, Is so there, they didn't. Can someone hear me? Yep. Hello. All right, let's untie you. Stay that safe. makes two out of six. Oh, we can get you out of here. Hang on. You said you said not yet. Do you think we're at risk from the toxin after all? Possibly. Possibly. It's a chemical weapon, Nadia. Right now, I'm more worried about the immediate problem at hand. No, th that makes sense. 
Sophia's gonna take us up a little higher. Please hang up on her again. Because that was funny as hell last time. It's like, hey, do you think a dude? She's like, ah. She got you, bitch. Okay, so we've got a semi-automatic pistol. I hear him, I don't see him, which scares me even more. He's not there. I don't know. I do not know where he is. Alright. So, we can climb across here? Yeah, we can. Okay, good, 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 good. Oh, thank you. Lara, bad news. When we shut down the towers, it's going to shunt the rest of the toxin to the central core. Which is what we expected, and we'll get it all in one place. But looking at the structural damage out here, there's no way the core is going to hold all that pressure after all these years. What's our worst case scenario? It explodes. The core containment fails, and a concentrated... Sorry, I just had to shut up. We've heard all okay, this gibberish before. There are four major systems in the facility. Japanese flag. The good news is they should be color coded and well marked. There's the water filter. Sorry, we've heard this right. too. Let's shut this place down. Here we go. We're looking for a large sealed cylinder. When you open it, you should see gas as well as a series of lights. Are they all off? If so, we find the red generator for the fuel pump system and start it up. If so not, here's then we need the thing. To make sure the conduits to the water filtration system are connected. Okay, so are the gas cylinder lights all off? No, they're not. They're blinking. Lower the blue water filtration conduit. All right, where's the blue water filtration conduit? Well, I'm pretty sure this is the right thing to do. That is the gas thing she's on about. Wait, is it? Um, biological catalyst, fuel pump. Yep, 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 yep. Gas cylinder. Yep. Okay, we picked the right thing. Now we just got to find the blue cylinders. And I'm pretty sure infected should be around here, shouldn't they? Wait, is it the conduit? Yep. Okay, so we got to lower that big blue thing on there, which involves us going up. Please. Yes, thank you, Lara. Making my life just a little bit easier. Right, hippity hop. Please be right. Don't be an alarm, please. Yes. That's it, Nadia. This tower's been shut down. What? Good. Now, it's going to vent all the remaining toxin to the central core. Once it's all in one place, we'll have to find a way to destroy it all. Hold on. Now, find the exit on the roof and head back outside. Did we only have to do one thing in the first tower last time? I honestly don't remember. Apparently so. Well, we do get a lovely strong box out here, which is fan blooded hastic. Lara, okay. bad news. When we shut down the towers, it's going to shunt the rest of the toxin to the central core. Oh, yes. Which is what we expected, and we'll get it all in one place. But looking at the structural damage out here, there's no way the core is going to hold all that pressure after all these years. What's our worst case scenario? The core containment fails, and a concentrated cloud of toxin gets dispersed in the wind. As bad as it gets. Well, that sounds pretty bad, but we just got ourselves a pistol suppressor and trident or... Wait, I'm not entirely sure what that said. It's something iron size, just an upgraded iron size. Don't be an alarm. Oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Alright, I think we're gonna have a little a tiny bit of light, a little bit more of a scout round, because the next tower's there than the last one's over there. So we might as well just dip into this area over here, just see if we can find ourselves any survivors or what have you. Alright, can we pull this off from here? We should okay, be able to. We've got a plan for the central Can core, you shut up? I don't think you're gonna like it. I'm tired of your ways. If you do get to, I mean, when you shut down the last tower, the central core won't be able to hold all that pressure. It's going to fail. But if you can get inside and overload the machinery all at once, you'll trigger a catastrophic failure, and the explosion will burn off the toxin. You're right. I don't like it, but it's all we've got. Bollocks. Oh, no one else knows I'm here. Let's get the hell out of here. Please. Please. Nope, they know I'm here. Oh shit. Not in front of the big guy. Why did it have to drop me down in front of the big guy? Are you kidding me? Run, Lara! Oh, please. Please. It's a shield guy. That's even worse than the guy with the axe. Okay, just head up, head up, head up. I will, give me a second. I'm under a bit of stress right now. Because I don't know how to deal with this guy. 
Oh, thank God. There's going to be one behind me, isn't there? Can they climb up like this? I would like to be optimistic and say no, but they probably can. Okay, we need to kill to stay alive. Goodbye to your face, sir. No. Oh my God, he did a backflip. That's the second coolest thing I've seen all day. I only say second quarter scene simply because we played Mirror's Edge today and, well, Mirror's Edge is just innately awesome. Okay, get all this stuff with a... <laughs> thank you. Oh my god, thank you. I thought that was my ass. Oh. Okay, we're getting a lot of ammo, which is fantastic. Can someone hear me? Yes, I hear you. Bear with me one second. I'm out here... Trying to live. You've got to get me out of here. I know. Do we need to come up with a call sign? You know, for the three of us, our team. Okay, here it comes. Here it comes. Let's just wait. Radio now, Nadia. Uh, okay, but think about it. We denied. Could be the... All right, let's pick lock this. There you go. Ancient abilities quickly fire two successive arrows without delay. Well, okay. So it seems that all the skills you get from uh, saving the prisoners are always the same. Well, they didn't know I was here. They do now, but still. I swear to God, if he comes up here, how in fresh freaking hell would you know I'm here? There is no way. All right, let's just um, go to the large exploding sound, please. Are you? No, they're coming round to me. Oh, fuck off. There is no way. You heard me. You heard a freaking explosion, but not... Oh, no. Come on. Load, load, load. The big un's coming. I don't even know if I can kill the big un. We're about to find out. This is like a... Okay, the big un is easy as hell to kill. This is like Call of Duty Zombies type stuff here. Camp in the corner or on the catwalk and just plow them as they come around the corner. Right, there's two guys coming. One right here. Now, if I hang down here, will they still attack me? Yes. Yes, they will. Good to know. I had a grenade. I had a grenade. Fuck this. I'm out. That what? How is that remotely fat? Okay, it's a zombie. It's a zombie. Well, not zombie. It's just an infection. Oh no! Hill, 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 hill! Stop hitting me, Lara! If you keep dropping and holding, I'ma slap you, stupid. Leave me alone. Right, we need to get back up here. Okay, he's jumping down. Oh my God! There's loads of them. Oh my good god, there's loads of them. Just run. Run, Lara. That's our only choice. Just go. Okay, just get up here. Get back up here. Loot all the bodies. Please. Thank you. We have no more healing herbs. We might be screwed here. I would rather it didn't take so long because we are wide open for an attack here. Thank God killing actually heals us, because if we ever get into a pinch, like running out of shotgun ammo, for one, the bodies are despawning, the bodies are despawning. No, 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 apparently yes, apparently yes. Heal, just... Okay, 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 load the shotgun. We only have one bullet. Nope, we're dead. Bugger. How far is he going to throw us back, though? Is he going to let me have saved the uh, the prisoner? It stuck us... Wait, what? We're still here. And we still have no herbs. Okay. Okay. Okay, we need to get up here. We need to just kill something. Come on. Kill it. Please, just... It's never taken four hits to kill something. Oh, sweet bejesus. Sweet mother of God. Okay, that should have healed us. It didn't heal us. That should have killed you, you lying prick. Lies. Oh, no. 
Thank you. Thank you. Can I please just get healed? Okay, we've been healed. Can we get the hell out of here? Okay, there's an infected in there. Please. Please let me jump on top of this container. Okay, okay, okay. We're good, we're good. We can sit here for a minute and just let them leave us alone. Or until we bleed out and die because I had to put that goddamn vampire perk on, didn't I? Uh, is there anyone here close, relatively, that I can kill? Yes. You lucky contestant. There you go. Okay, I'm going to pause because we're on a time limit. But uh, guys, I think that's going to do it for this episode of uh, the Expedition of Rise of the Tomb Raider for the Cold Darkness DLC. Hopefully you approve of my card choices. Apologies for failing two challenges within like 10 seconds, but I might have bitten off a slight bit more than I can chew here. So this is going to be a bloody fun time for our final expedition with Lara Croft herself. But nonetheless, hopefully you guys have enjoyed. If you have, be sure to drop a like down below. Let me know what you think about our card selection and challenge selection. I'm pretty sure I've nailed it with bitten off too much or well, more than I can chew kind of thing. That kind of just right on, right on the money. But let me know what you think about it in the comment section down below. And finally, guys, if this is the kind of content that you do enjoy to watch, be sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already because we are proudly and amazingly sat at 111 subscribers right now and it's bloody fantastic to have the support from you guys. Oh, and of course, if you do decide to subscribe, you get to keep up to date with all of our uploads. And if you're new here, we upload three videos a day, seven days a week, seven ongoing series, and it's bloody fantastic stuff and I very much enjoy making content for you guys. But anyway... Thank you all for watching, and until next time, I shall see you all later. I must have been mad as hell to use these cards, good god.